Hey guys, it's Master of the Builder here. This is Ouija's Mansion Game 4. It's coming out in 2025. I decided to play it, but. There's a fourth one that's coming out soon, but I thought it would be a great idea. Just my story vision. Like, well, sorry. Not trying to be rude. And I did saw the idea her from Nintendo Land. And he said, sorry, I was trying my best spelling it, but I think his idea was actually a good idea. Like, castle or train or mall or cruise, yeah, cruise boat and the others. I think it was a great idea, but I did thought instead of doing like one big place, I think it should just be like similar to Ouija's Mansion 2 or Dark Moon. And Sorry, I just have autism, and as an autistic person, I do like colors. My favorite color is blue. And, um, there's some of my ideas for the game. And this is the Poltergeist, but more gadgets, and still have same, but different like we can get laser claw or detector punching through windows and and a hook you know that shoots yeah and I did thought it'd be a good idea if I give him like a jet pad like kids that jump like you know what I mean and there's Oh, I forgot. And there's some, like, you can see ghosts and the other object. And this is supposed to be a, a, a robot, Luigi. Yeah, it does not be a three-player. You can still have Luigi, but I thought third-player would be a... Yeah. And there's... Some of my ghost idea for the sequel. Yeah, well, there's. I thought it'd be a good idea when they were good at the beginning and turn good again. I know what you're wondering. Who is this big shadowy figure? Well. He was meant to, he's similar and he's kind of like a lot from Epic Mickey, but you know, the big ink monster, I'm not talking about the ink demon from Benny at the Ink Machine, not him. The, the new game is coming out, Epic Mickey Rebrush. Sorry, I was just getting excited. And this is another villain, the man... Scientists. I just put the name so you can know. There's some reference for the ghost, like Johnny. I got that name from the well, from the Shining and Fatty. It's just fat. Don't know why. I just thought it was funny, and I did find a guy that goes. One of the ghosts that was actually good throughout the entire game, like never get kidnapped by King Boo or never turn bad, is Sweetie, the blue one with wings, like represented the angel. And there's some two boss fight I like to add on, like this guy and this guy. I know what you think. Is it similar to, well, it's similar, but different look. 
decided to change a big guy's color because, well, you know, like, there's three big red tough ghosts. As, sorry, as an autistic person, I just thought it would be a good idea for the sequel. That big shadowy figure, if Nintendo doesn't like the idea, I thought it would be a good backup plan to, instead of death, I should just give another main villain, like Bowser, Bowser, like two main villains for the fifth game, you know, like, they side team um to scare Luigi to death, Bowser just had his skeleton army, you know, from the Mario movie and the other games. Comment which villain would you like the idea the most? Well, sorry. And this is the mad scientist. He was meant to. He used to work with Professor Egad, but when he died and some of the other girls gained love and attention to. Professor E. Get and he and his name is Dr. Tix and he gets jealous heck of a jealous of Professor E. Gad. When he was just feeling gloomy for days or years. That is until King Boo destroyed the dark moon. And he saw that but he realized what if I team up with him? Thought maybe he did try to find him, but he's a ghost. So, ghost, when they're, you know, I mean, like, they're hard to see, but, yeah. Like, he decided to build some robots to destroy Luigi. And Professor E. Gad. And, and I thought he'd be a good villain. I, I could possibly see Helen and his, and her kitty, or her ghost cat, could possibly be in the fourth game. And I thought it'd be a good story beginning, like where King Boo and Helen and her cat. They. It's just my story idea. Like, they knew they break out of their container. And then. I thought it'd be a cute idea if some of the ghosts were dressed as police officers trying to arrest King Boo and the other. Booze. And they escaped and find the hideout. And they saw the mad scientist robot, his name is Dr. Tick. He introduced him. And he even realized that he can be pretty useful with his technology, like hacking Professor Egad's stuff. And King Boo just like the idea and they just team up trying to destroy Luigi mamma mia and the morning when they're being invited by the ghost lands where Luigi just thought it was some kind of Halloween stuff I thought it'd be a good idea if the mushroom kina was decorating for Halloween in the more, in the morning they decided to pack up and we really feel like it's gonna be a trick again. And when they're packing, I thought it'd be a good idea if he had his own poltergeist. If he still have it, like you can test it out. And he still have poltergeist, like he's lit. 
decided to leave his home. Well, yeah. And decided to go to bus. Like, there's, I feel like Peach, Yoshi, or Daisy may appear in the game. And when they were getting ready, when they arrived, when Luigi noticed there was colorful ghosts like flying around him, just trying to scare him, but Luigi just panicked like, no, not again. And Luigi thought it was a try, but it's not. And ghosts were like, ah, man, I'm just messing with you. Hey, welcome to our ghost kingdom. Well, yeah. Like another side. I thought it would be a good idea to. If these ghosts had their own town and. And. I could possibly imagine Luigi exploring for a little bit with. I thought it would be a great comeback. Like, you know, the second and a third ghosts. Like, Goom. Greeny, Slammer, Hammer, and Creeper, and other ghosts. I thought it'd be a great idea if they could appear again in Luigi's Mansion game. But when they're introduced, like, hey, you made my new ghost friends. Luigi's like, hmm, they look different color. Like, decided to. Need some get some rest for like you no, know, it was gay land and I were just having a good time and they're just getting settled and that is until King Boo just breaks out of cabin stuff like in the ghost like hey um they're not allowed to break in do you have permission? King Boo actually kidnaps all the ghosts, the new ghosts, except Sweetie the ghost, knowing he needs to warn Luigi and all of his ghost friends to hide underground so they can never see, you know, their ghosts. So, yeah, they can never die. They can't get hurt by bullets. Get it? Sorry. And we, Mario and other, and Yoshi try to fight back on King Boo. But, sad, unfortunately, they do get pictured again. But, he, King Boo just flies away and that is until he saw Luigi and Luigi just stared at him and just run similar to the third game where instead of like Luigi try to save Mario but and Pultra Girl like lead him like run and King Boo, King Boo try to chase after him pain again and he found a safe place where all the all the, like, all the ghosts are just sleeping is, that is until Luigi just panicked, warning everyone, and I could possibly imagine, like, Slammer or Hammer don't think he was acting cray-cray, but, and Sweetie the ghost warned him to get down quick, when they realized, oh dang, we had to hide. And they did, but they saw King Boo just try to find Luigi, but they helped Luigi find a good spot. And they realized, like, where is King Boo going? I could see they can use, like, a Professor Ike drone. They just fly around to see what he's doing. When King Boo just brainwash these ghosts, turn them mean and rude and they were like, how are we supposed to turn back to normal? How are we supposed to stop him? And Luigi 
feel like he got an idea. He thought, Professor Egan, maybe he can help us. And the ghosts were like, oh dang, I forgot about him. We need to... Hey, I thought it would be a good idea to... If Luigi has his own... Sh uh, Professor Egan has his own ship shelter, like... Kind of like... It looks like a UFO to me in my head, well... I thought it would be a good idea if, if he has his own ship. Like, hey, come on everybody, we're gonna save the ghost kingdom. And they decided going to ship and trying to take down and playing to take down King Boo. And I did thought it'd be a good idea if he showed him a new poltergeist what Professor E got made. And thought he giving him a robotic Luigi like three players, and he th and he gave him like a ghost helper like similar to like Ghost Trap from the Ghostbuster but different. Like, which ghost do you need, or which ghost is stronger, faster, or most most hiding, or most sneakiest? I thought it'd be a great idea that and these ghosts could be useful, similar to Gooigi. And I did thought it'd be a good idea. At the end, I, the final boss, well, I thought it'd be a good idea they could take down King Boo's castle. And I thought Helen and Dr. Tick, the mad scientist ghost, trying to destroy Luigi with his robotic stuff trying to kill Luigi but he still had well Helen and Dr. Chick has Luigi's friends and the brain mind control stuff to you know that control the making ghosts yes yeah sorry and I did thought it'd be a great idea if Baba making two epic final boss. Like, like trying to take down his robot to shoot at them. Or use like a robotic bombs to destroy his machine. And others. And I did thought when they get captured again, Ouija turned the ghost back to normal, and all the ghosts were thankful for him. And Mark, he got we and Ouija got his friends back, and they're like, "Thank you for him," like cheering for him, but. Why the ghosts realize like King Boo, King Boo, we need to, like, he said we need to, we need to stop him. We is like okay, and they all went up trying to destroy the curse once and for all in the castle. And King Boo's like, what do you think you're doing? When King Boo was threatening everyone. Well, he said, I'm going to put all of you in the painting. And some of the ghosts sacrificed herself like, you're going to have make me through. Count me in. Yeah. Go through me first. And uh, King Boo was like, you serious? And King Boo realized that it, it just, Ouija destroyed the curse of them. Turning them nice again. And King Boo was furious, and he captured all of the ghosts, including Greeny and other ghosts. Yeah, sadly you can use him at the final boss. I think King Boo would still be a final boss in the top of the 
castle look different. And another one is where Kimu escaped his vacuum cleaner like the second one. But this time but this time when King Boo just went down and he decided to make something bigger. He I thought the final boss would fit in the game, like the giant knight returns, but instead of larger but bigger. Almost size like a mountain. Trying to destroy Ouija. And Ouija's free all of his friends again. He got a ship. And I thought it would be a good epic chase scene. Where you had to fight the giant. You had to shoot down the armored knight. Where armored King Boo was wearing. Um, shooting down laser. Like pew pew. And... I thought you got to have a one giant laser cannon Oops. and dis demolish and destroy the armor suit for King Boo. And, and they actually, and King Boo lost his crystal well, diamond in his crown again. This time, King Boo was like furious. Saw like a red laser ray, but he was and die. And I did saw him. Sorry, he's had another Ouija, and he thought it was a death ray, but it's not. Yeah, good luck for him. And he thought it was a death ray, but it's just more like reflection or flashing. And King Boo was like, oh. <laughs> I can explain it. All the ghosts got here. It's like, look like they're about to beat him up. And King was like, okay, I can explain. Okay. And then ghosts dressed up like a cop actually arrested all the boos and King Boo and Helen and Dr. Perf Dr. Tick. And they're like helping. They thought. Professor E guy would make a good mayor in Ghost Town. And they thought the judge ghost like we'll keep an eye on you so you won't escape again. Rikimu was like, You can't do this to me and like King Boo was just being locked up again. And I thought it'd be interesting to see him at the prison, like where he meets the villain, like Death or Bowser, meeting each other. I feel like they should just team up. They feel like they, well, and at the end again, I thought it'd be a good idea. All the ghosts were like, thank you for him and thanks for your help. Like, Sonny's happy day and ghosts were like thankful for him as a hero. Thought making statue of him for being a hero of the ghost town. And um that's pretty much it the game and that was just my story idea guys. I just thought it'd be a good idea to Make a good storyline, the fourth one. I think it would be a good idea if there was like a backstory, or I think it would be a good idea if they put life lessons. Like, you don't have, there's nothing to be afraid about, or it's just, I just thought it would be a good, I think there should be a life lesson and others. And I did thought, oh, that would be. If we're like, we can just visit. I thought it'd be a great idea. They, we could just visit the entire town, like, like the guy who named, yeah.
sorry. I thought it'd be good. If you playing like stair scraper, that tall one, I thought it'd be great idea. If you're one player, I thought it'd be a great idea. Like what time you want to have? Like you could choose like twenty minutes, ten minutes, or five minutes, or fifteen minutes. I just thought it'd be a good idea for the sequel game. I just thought this level will be much or this scare scraper. I just thought it'd be a good idea for a sequel. Comment down below which fourth game will be a good idea for a sequel. Bye.